Yo, ladies and gentlemen, welcome to my quick tutorial of Python using uh, SymPy. So I'm going to be solving polynomials and um, do a few other things inside as well. So factoring and all that. So what I'm going to start doing is um, I'm going to import uh, SymPy. So, so from, sorry. Yeah. And then my sim uh, symbols that I'm going to use X, Y, and Z. Right, and um, sometimes you use the init uh, the, these uh, function. Sorry, there's a code that says right. So that there, it's just to so you get really tidier answers. So I'm not gonna use it. Um, in the first few questions, but I'll use it um, somewhere individual and let you know exactly what um, what's going on. So um, so I won't use it for now. So I'll just leave that for now. Okay. And then um, so I'm gonna start off by solving six x squared plus five x minus four. So solve. Plus five x. Minus four, sorry, minus four. Then solving for x. So here are answers. And then I'll solve another one as well. So I'll solve um, x squared minus eight x. Right, so the roots zero and eight, yeah. And then I'll solve another one as well, another quadratic. So x squared Solving for x again, so minus one and one. Okay, so now um, I'm gonna solve um, a cubic. So this is where I want you guys to um, understand exactly what I mean by that. Why why I find this is important anyway for me personally anyway. So I'm gonna start with solving the cubic. Solve uh, x cubed. So x cubed. Um, plus two x squared yeah minus x minus sorry minus one solving for x right some code has come up right but then it looks a bit you know it's it's correct anyway but it looks a bit untidy for me but uh you know, it's all subjective anyway. So if I use that initial printing pip now, so can't spell today. Right, and then I'm just going to copy and paste that equation again. Okay, still a bit, you know, but it's all subjective anyway. But I, I prefer, I prefer that. You know, I prefer that. You know, S to compare to that. So these all, I mean, that's subjective. So if you don't, if you don't use that, you'd get these kind of answers. But if you use um, that code, you'd get these kind of things. Okay, right. So. So it's it's all up to you anyway what you want to do if you want to use it or you don't want to use it you don't have to but I prefer using it you know so yeah so now uh, I'm gonna solve um, a system of linear equations so I'm gonna call my equation a and then two x plus three y that's equal to two and then I'm gonna call my b four x plus y and that's equal to four, right? And then what I need to do is I'm gonna put these uh, equations into matrix form, so system, so this matrix, so two, three, and then two. So that's the first equation, and then four, 
1 and 4. And that's the second equation. <coughs> right. So now I want to solve that. You know, so what I'll do is I'll type in this code solve linear system and then system again for x and y. Yeah, just to make sure that I've typed in the code correctly. Yep. So I got my x is one and my y is zero. So if you work that yourself, you you definitely get that. If you get if you do it right, you get that. Okay, so that's how um, you'd solve a system of linear equations. And then now, um, there's a way as well if you want to check your solutions. So say for instance, um, I'm going to go by, I'm going to use that equation. So I want to check if the solutions are correct. So I can just say check, check solve, right? And then um, x squared minus 1 equals 1. Sorry, x then 1. That's true. But then if you put a random number, so obviously you get false. So I'm just, I'm just going to do it anyway. And that's 3. Yeah, so that's false. So that's a, another way of just checking your solutions anyway. Or if somebody's giving you a solution, you can just check it that way. And then um, factoring. So I can factor out... Um, polynomials so factor so I'm gonna factor that saves me from typing again yeah and here we are so 2x minus 1 right times 3x plus 4 so that's how you factor that's how you use the factoring method on um, in SimPy Okay, so yeah, so those, this was just a quick one, and um, hope you, hopefully you guys um, like it. And uh, if you've got any questions or any other uh, comments and suggestions, please feel free to hit me up at the bottom. So have a lovely day. So have a good one, guys. Have a lovely day. Cheers, and bye-bye.